I forgot to put the hood back on my car. Woo! for giving me these delicious walnuts. I like them very much. You are a nice person. I will be sure to come back tomorrow to get some more walnuts. You are my favorite person in the neighborhood. I like you. started. I'm building a butterfly hut and uh, here are some of the measurements. These are two by four by eights and to this one here I got the roof slanted so the rain runs off but to this one here is six foot and to this outside one is six and a half foot. All right moving on. All right sorry I forgot to take some video and pictures but uh it's almost done got the framework all done it's about 18 inches by two feet foot and a half by two foot put some screen on it so i'm gonna put a plant on here when the caterpillars uh do the business it'll fall down through the screen here so i'm gonna put a two plywood sides on a plywood back and a plywood roof got the pieces all measured out just got to cut them and uh screw them on might paint it white. I don't know yet. We'll see. Well, thanks for tuning in. That's how you build the butterfly hut. I'm going to be putting a screen uh, door on the front here. Somehow. I haven't figured it out. Holy crap! What are you doing? I almost crap my pants! What are you doing? Slow down! I thought you were going to go flying by me. Go! that stuff when I was a kid. That's what I want to know. Witness it. It did snow again. May 9th. Last time it happened was in the early 70s for me. Alrighty, it did happen. May 9th. Snowing out right now. I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, snowing May 9th, 2020. That ties the record from the early 70s. I was in fourth grade, it snowed on May 9th. Alright, you saw it. Alrighty, just picked up some plywood from my niece's husband. So kind of gave me a few pieces, and they fit perfect. Just had to cut them. I got the two sides on. I only got one screw in that one, so I gotta take it off to put the back on. 
I got the roof all set. So once I take this side piece off, I'll sneak that uh, back piece in there. I'm just going to put a 2x4 across the top there. And you put the plywood up in there and put the side piece back in. And I just got to build a door for it. Be ready to go. And I'm still deciding whether I want to paint it maybe white, maybe gray to match that building back there. I don't know. Put it in the comments. Let me know what you think. Later. All right, real quick. Got the last 2x4 in. Put that up there. Put the back piece on. I'll just get a milkweed plant put inside there. And then once I uh, start getting caterpillars on it, I'll put a door over the top of it. Once uh, butterflies are done laying their eggs. All right. I just got to decide whether to paint it white or gray. Leave it in the comments below with what you think. Thanks for tuning in. All right, you got her painted. I just got to put another piece of screen in here. Go halfway across the holes here. Put another piece of screen hanging from the ceiling so they can hang off of it. And then make a screen door for it. Once all the eggs are laid. Oh, and of course a milkweed plant. Hoping these come back. Got one there. One over there. I'll have to wait and see. Thanks for giving me these delicious walnuts. I like them very much. You are a nice person. I will be sure to come back tomorrow to get some more walnuts. You are my favorite person in the neighborhood. I like you. Oh, I had a grandpa. He was clever. He could do some funny tricks. He invented a freezing liquid nobody else knew how to mix. Took some out into the kitchen where Graham was a making pie. Drop a drop to into the fire, froze right there, right before her eyes. Well, me and Grandpa fishing down by the riverside. Stopped the thought a half a minute. Boy, would sure be great. Freeze that river in a half an hour so the boys and girls could skate. Went right home for a bottle of the liquid. Dropped it into the river quick. Less time than it takes to tell it. Ice on the river, one foot thick. Oh boy, what a sight to see. Boys and girls were skating there. Thermometer up to 103. Well, Grandpa, he got old and feeble, and his eyesight wasn't good. Drank a bottle of that freezing liquid, and froze right there, right where he stood. Miss you, Grandpa. Love you, Ben.
<laughs> you thought this stuff was over. Not yet. I forgot to uh, show you the finished product. What a gorgeous morning. It's like 50 degrees out. It's going to be a nice day. It's Sunday. I think the uh, 17th of March. I'm sorry, 17th of May. I put another layer of screen on here so it overlays in some area, trying to make the holes smaller. But uh, the camera angle ain't doing it. But if I push it down, it does maybe. And then I put a screen on top there. So when they go up and crawl up there, they can uh, do their J hook off of here and hang and turn into crystals. And that'd be cool. Got me a couple more milkweed plants. I think they're both the same kind, yeah, that's all they had. But she did tell me to cut these ones back to a couple inches high. Yeah, there's the green stuff she said will start coming out of them. There it is. Uh, they're starting to come up. Cool beans. All right. These will get about two feet high, maybe three feet, almost to the top here, probably. But the caterpillars will live on them for, I don't know, three to four weeks. And they get up to like three inches long, the size of your pinky, probably. Yeah, let's see how many we get this year. All right. It's almost a two minute video. So I added to the end of that, make it about 15 minutes. That's long enough. But hey guys, thanks for coming, hanging out tonight. Appreciate it. I gotta hurry up and make this video Sunday morning now. I gotta upload it for tonight and make it a premiere video. <laughs> I better hurry up. You know, well, I'm gonna order some butterfly stickers and throw on there too. Waterproof ones. Put them on both sides. When I do, I'll get some pictures of it. Real quick, I just want to take a walk down and uh, see if this one's coming up too. I don't see much on this one. I'll check it next time. Alright. You guys have a good night. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Ain't much left, but uh, have a safe week. We'll see you Saturday night. Later.